Hello my fellow nerds and welcome back to another episode of Road to Raw, the series where I attempt to get every single weapon in Splatoon 2 to the Raw rank. I'm your host, Noah. The rules are in the description if you want to check them out. But without further ado, let's see what weapon we're going to be using today. Our numbers are 3 and 7. 1, 2, 3. And then number 7 is the Custom Jet Squelcher. Did I finally get a weapon I kind of know how to use? Wow. Okay, sweet. Uh, yeah, there's the Custom Jet Squelcher. I'll talk more about it in the first match, but let's just hop right into the games. Okay, Sturgeon Shipyard. The other map is actually actually no, I'm just gonna leave it a secret because I think we're gonna I think we're gonna end up playing on it. I, I'm not gonna tell you what it is. You'll just have to figure it out. <laughs> it's it's been a running gag at this point, but I I won't, I won't say it, I won't say it. So some things you need to know about the jet sculpture. It is if if you can't tell, it's extremely long range, so very precise weapon. Uh, it can take out people. Like look at that, I'm hitting the shots from all the way over there. Um, so, very long range. I'm going to end up dying here, probably. Nope. I'm good. Ooh! I'm, I'm gonna keep saying the same thing. Extremely long range. Uh, it's a rapid fire weapon, so all I have to do is just hold down the button, and it does it for me, and I walked into that dude. My apologies. Its sub is the burst bomb. An extremely powerful bomb that does somewhat good damage, but... It explodes on impact, so it's pretty good for taking out an enemy or getting the jump on someone. Or just getting down area really quickly, and you can actually throw more than one at a time on a full ink tank. That's also pretty beneficial. But it's a case-by-case kind of thing. I like burst bombs a lot. They're not anything crazy, but they can help. Uh, can I laser you? No, I cannot. Unfortunate. And then, as you saw, the Stingray is the other super. I actually used the Stingray in one of the earlier challenges. I don't remember what one had Stingray. Um, I'm not a big fan of it, but it's considered one of the best supers in the game, so. There's an example of that really good range. Um, but you just kind of have to stay back. You can't really get in too much. You, you need to know, like, oh, I gotta pick my fights from far away. Which I'm really bad at, because I, I like to get in there and get my hands dirty. Let's see. Can I get you? Yes, yes, wait. Oh, that's not good. Okay. But I mean, like, I'm contesting with this sniper, who's all the way up there, which is crazy. This person will probably... Okay, they gotta rush me if they wanna... There they go! <laughs> They were not trying to mess with me until the very end there, where they knew I was going to lose the fight. Let's get this down. Uh, I don't know if I mentioned this previously. This weapon is currently at a 2.5. I've played with it before a little bit. So, in theory, the perfect video would be to win three games in a row. But I do have tolerance for one loss, so... I'm going to try to... There we go. Good. And then there's some person over there. I hit him. Go. I'm gonna back up and use this. Oh, I see him. I hit him for quite a bit, but it wasn't enough. Probably should have just gone in and got ink. Is that a win for us? It looks pretty good, but I we might have lost that one. Yeah, just by a little bit. So we are currently down to a 2.0. We still win three games in a row and keep it going, but. Not a bad start, especially for a loss, that was pretty solid. Oh, do, do you guys recognize this? Potentially, maybe. This is Humpback. If you haven't watched my other videos, the joke doesn't make any sense, but almost every single video that I've posted, I've played on this map at least once. <laughs> I, I don't know why that is. I don't attempt to get this map every single time. I do like this map a lot. I just find it odd that it keeps showing up for some reason. I couldn't tell you why that happens. We're going to use this and not worry about humpback anymore. Oh, they splashed down. Interesting choice. Uh, oh, whoa, hello. I am so sorry, Ultra Noob. They just kind of belong to me. Is this going to be another case of a really, really good Squiffer player? Because it kind of looks like a piece of wheeze. I can't even hit him. 
Oh, they can't hit me though. Haha. <laughs> oh! Oh, I thought I got him. I just need some more health. There we go. Oh, you missed. You missed again. There we go. I guess the first one was just a really good shot, but man, it looked very impressive from my point of view. I'm gonna use this so I get ink back. Might have been a waste. It's okay. Oh, I'm here to help. They're hurting. There we go. Good teamwork on that one. Oh, gosh. Um... Yes, good. They waste their shot. I can't take this fight. I'm too close. There we go. Oh. Oh. Okay. Sweet. That was a triple. Nice job, me. I'm going to get some ink down since I have so much range. I might as well. I'm going to back up so I can use my ult. There's some people over here. Uh, they aren't over there anymore. I tried. I'm still over here, buddy. There you yeah. go. Uh. <laughs> the fear in my voice, it was... I was, I was terrified. <laughs> I was backed up in the corner. I just had to aim, and I was struggling a little bit, I'll be honest, but I got it. <laughs> We're good. There we go. Good. And then I'm going to get... Oh. Excuse me. Sir, could I ask you to please stop? Dang it. I didn't get anyone. But I think that's a win for us. We had most of the middle. They got the right, but we had the left. I feel pretty good about that. Awesome. We are now up to a 3.0. So two more games, unless we lose one. Which is a-okay. Top of the leaderboard. Uh, not with kills, but with ink. Oh, actually, I tied. I tied with that person. I haven't seen a tie in a really long time. That's pretty cool. Let's head on out to the next game. Double sniper. Not sure what I think about that. But the squiffer at least hit me without one good shot in the last game. So maybe they'll they'll do well. An E-leader, I'm not sure about. I, I, I'm not very good with it. I've talked about my struggles to get the E-leader to raw way back when. It was not my not my brightest moment. Uh, there are a lot of people and I don't know who to focus on. I throw that at you. Oh, he's one. There we go. Oh, you! Hi! I'm so sorry. Okay, Squiffer got him. Nice. The missile's actually the thing that ended up killing me and not the, uh, not the person. I'm gonna put that down real quick. Yeah, a lot of, a lot of ink. Okay. Oh, I really thought I would have had them there. Oh, but they got away. I tried to put the, uh, the bomb there so they couldn't move as much, but... I gotta run... There's a lot going on here. I'm gonna be honest. Okay. I'm alive. I'm hurting, but I'm alive. Come chase me. Yeah, come get me. Yeah. You won't. Ooh. I'm gonna stop you there. Good. I'm gonna go this way and get some ink down. Oh, wow. That almost took my head off. He was not messing with that, though. Maybe that's what I should have done. If I missed, I just run. I don't know if I brought this up earlier, but last carbon roller. <laughs> that was really tough on me. Oh, I almost got him. Well, I think all I hit was the bomb. I don't think I got any other hits. See, I'm, I'm getting too close, though. I gotta know when to back off. Uh, take that. Oh, oh! My goodness! Okay, so I guess the shot that, that Squiffer did get on me was was fair, because, man, that was... They've been hitting good stuff. Um, I'm going to do this. I hit one for a little bit. Now, the issue with standing here is that they can just sneak up from down below, like this person will probably end up trying to do. But they pay the price for it. So I just gotta be careful. Don't worry, sir, I will help you. I will outrange them. Ow. <laughs> I didn't hit them at all. 
Um, I'm just, I'm just being annoying at this point. Let me get some. Oh, yeah, come here, come here. Actually, don't come here. I'm gonna regroup. I'm gonna try to get that. Da -da 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 -dome. I will not die. Let's go. We are at a 4.0 if that was a win, but they're in the danger zone. Feeling pretty good about that. And... Boom. 4.0. Do I... I already have to reminisce on the weapon. I only played a couple games with it. It's really good game by me, again. Uh, not top of the leaderboard in points, but definitely am in the splats category, so that's pretty solid. Okay, so here are my opinions on this weapon. Uh, I think it's pretty good. It's very powerful because its long range allows it to just... You can send them back and take out people pretty easily. Usually, long range weapons have quite a punishing factor to where maybe you have to charge something up, like a normal charger, or you have to uh, let something spin up, or you don't get very many shots. This is kind of the best of all worlds. You get a ton of shots, really long range. Uh... Do I... Oh, what the... I'm just gonna run. Do I like this sub? Yes. Do I like the super? Not as much. It's a take it or leave it kind of thing. I'm... I, every once in a while, I'll do well with the Stingray. Most of the time, I don't. So, like this, I'm gonna try to, like, get someone, and I won't. Oh, but then I hit them for a lot. It makes me question, like, maybe it is good. Now, I'm extremely hurt... Not just physically, but emotionally, because you attempted to... I should not have. <laughs> I should not have tried that. I just sat still and tried to shoot him. But overall, I do think the weapon is pretty solid. If I lose this match, oh well. I'll get to use it some more. I haven't been recording hardly at all at this point. So, I, I'm not going to complain. More games with the weapon I'm good with, I will certainly take that. Definitely over a lot of game or a few games with a weapon that I'm not very good with. Because, you know, I enjoy this a little bit. Okay. There are two snipers, and I have to figure out which one is Ultra New, because they destroy me every single time. They play pretty aggressive, though. For the most part. Good shot. Um, you know what? Aggressive v. Aggressive. Oh, never mind. They're, they're gone. But, like, look at this. I'm, I'm getting free ink right now just because they are... Or, just by standing in the middle. Okay, that person's gone. Um, you know what? Oh, wait. I can just... Counter Sniper. Come here! <laughs> okay, they're gone. Number two. Can I get number two? Oh, I hit him for a little bit. No. Oh. This person, I don't know where they went. Oh, they're there. Can't let you have the middle, I'm sorry. The bomb? I thought the bomb was going to take him out. I didn't want to steal that. Let me just go get some more free ink just by standing up here. <laughs> this weapon is fairly commonly used in competitive because a long-range weapon is kind of necessary for most game modes. And it's pretty easy to use. Look at that. That's crazy. We're already done. I've been recording for 16 minutes. This video is going to be tiny. Oh my gosh. Well, there you go. <laughs> 5.0. Let's, let's look at the freshness bonus. Not too bad on the leaderboard. They were missing someone. That tends to be the, the deal breaker. If someone le uh, leaves. But there it is. Freshness bonus of 3,000. So that was pretty pretty quick. I'll see you guys in the outro. And that's going to do it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching as always. A short video. I don't think anyone's going to complain after most of mine have been in the mid-30s. I don't even know how long this one's going to be. Like 10? <laughs> but as always, thank you guys for watching. And I can't wait to see you for the next episode.